So, just thought I'd walk you through some of my favorite features of uh, Olive Tree's Bible Reader app. A little, uh, little full screen here. Reading Sonic Songs with my wife. So, first off, what's awesome is having the different Bible versions over here. Um, I have my NIV and my ESV. It comes free with the King James. And I'm not really sure how I got the American Standard Version, but there it is. Um, you know, so if you want to go somewhere, let's go to Proverbs. I've been teaching Sunday School out of Proverbs, and we're ready for Proverbs 13 right now. So we'll go to Proverbs. And you can see here that my, uh, my highlights and stuff are, are here. They're all here. Um, if I had any notes in my phone or anything, they would be here. But you can view all of that here, and this is super handy. Um, you know, we can pull up what does the ESV say in Proverbs chapter 14 at the same time. That's really cool. Um, yeah, I'm saying a lot of um, I'm sorry. So we got Matthew Henry's commentary. I like Matthew Henry's commentary. Proverbs 13, you know, we can look at, at that. So, you know, it's pretty cool. I like this, you know, I'm going to say, and it'll take me there in my commentary and in my Bible. I don't have to like flick through pages and stuff like that. And you know, they've got your whole library here that you have that you can pull down. Um, you can go to the store. And they've got like a billion things in the store here. Uh, yeah, Bible knowledge commentary. That's something I want. It's actually on sale right now for $28. But. So, overall, it's pretty good. Uh, it's a really useful app. It's really built for study more than anything. And you've got my stuff here. We can back up and sync. And this will take us to the phone. Like, it'll back it up to the phone and everything. Anyway. That is my take on it. Um, it's a pretty useful app. It's free in the Mac App Store. I don't know what it is, how you get it on PC, but it's free in the Mac App Store. And uh, I really like it. I really use it a lot. I read it on my phone all the time. Uh, anyway, just thought I'd share.